On the Ecodam, we have the option to be able to use the immersion heater to do the hot water. We're only going to do this in an emergency situation. So if the installer's asked you to do it, or you've spoken to Mitsubishi Electric after sales and they've asked you to do it. So I'm going to show you how to do it. Go to the top right hand side, three lines. I'm going to go down to service. Default passcode is four zeros. Scroll down to heat source. Get a tick. It'll ask you to shut down the Ecodan. Go into it again. And we're going to check it from being standard to being heater. So heater means use the immersion heater instead. Give that a tick. Comes up saying confirmed. And then we come back out. Exit the service menu. And we come back to the front screen. You'll notice it's all off at this moment in time because we've changed the functionality. So click back at the three lines, switch the unit back on, and I'm going to force it to do some hot water. So click on the hot water. From there, I'm going to press that start button. When I press the start button, you're going to hear the immersion heater cut in. And then when I come back to the front screen, You'll see now it's got a little symbol at the top there representing a lightning bolt, which is our representation for an immersion heater. So I say it's only a temporary measure to get you around the problem.